up, ladies and gentlemen? I'm your host, Trans Editor Yank, coming at you with some more taste test action. Today, we're taking a look at. Um, I was actually surprised I actually found these. Um, these are the new Ritz Crispers. And uh, they're supposed to be baked with real cheese. Yeah, okay. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, but, like I said, there was like uh, Ritz Crispers. Delightful, crispy, and cheesy. And I got the cheddar version. Um, I think there's only, we might have brought two versions of these out, but I got the cheddar version. Um, but, you know, I like how people pull out in front of me, too. <laughs> I don't think they see anything. Okay. But, uh, anywho, uh, these are the Ritz Crispers. And, uh, definitely, uh, these bad boys open. On my way to a cookout today. But first, I'm going to head to Wally World out in this area, see if they have any new exclusive uh, stuff, especially food items. Because I love to eat. We all love to eat, right? <laughs> but, uh, you know, let me get this bag of crispers open. We're on a straight stretch now. Look, Ma, no hands. Ah! Oh, I can smell it already. Grab one. Cheese crispers. You can almost see the texture on it. They are actually really good. Really good. They're thin, they're nice and nice and thin. I would say these are better than Jesus snapped. Because Ritz, Ritz uh, always surprises you with stuff. Oh yeah, very good. And I like cheese. Uh, I love cheese. But yeah, I'm trying to see is like. Uh, Carbohydrates 7%. Sugars, one gram. Why would you put sugar in a teaspoon? Doesn't make any sense. But, uh, yeah, they're pretty good. I like them. See, so yeah, ladies and gentlemen, there's their rich cheese crispers. Definitely, uh, highly recommended, ladies and gentlemen. So, further ado, I don't want to make the video any longer than it has to be. But, uh, but uh, I have a good buddy, my good buddy Ward. He's gonna try these, and he's gonna tell you what he thinks of them too. So I'll catch you guys next time, and uh, definitely hope you guys enjoyed the rest of the video and Ward's taste test. So until next time, don't forget to check everybody's links down in the description down below. So until next time, ladies and gentlemen, this is your host Transan38 doing a taste test video on the new Ritz, Ritz cheese crispers, delightful, crispy, and cheesy. So, so yeah, until next time, hope you guys enjoy, uh, enjoy the rest of the video, so, this Trans Am 3 talk to you, I'm out later, I'm going to go look for a Class 5, because I'm in the Ecto vibe, so, catch you guys later. 
Uh, hey, I'm trying to keep cool here, so I'm just standing in front of the freezer um, all day. But uh, seriously, okay, well, I've done a video about this before, but I can do this again here. These are the cheddar and, um, well, they go with strong smell, you know, not a bad one, but they're okay. I think they're, I said they were burnt in another video, but I think maybe they're just overbaked and... I'm not keeping cookies and or um, actually cookies in the freezer would make sense. Crackers don't. These, however, the um, four cheese and herb. Um, I think you can see the was originally at least up to here, so I've eaten at least half of these already. There's an endorsement. Hey, this is Web Junior 1977 here. Try out these uh, cheese crispers from Ritz. Thanks, with real cheese. I think I should just put it on there, baked with fake cheese one time, just just see what fucking people do. It'd be funny. Get a whole basically a. Uh, Nothing on one side. I mean, it's a little bit on that side, but most of it's on one side. Kind of like a Pringle. Basically, it tastes like a cheese it. It's not the bad thing, I guess. Pretty damn good, though. One thing I didn't notice, though, before... It kind of tastes like a cheese, but it also kind of tastes like those, there's a type of chip. I can't remember what the heck, heck they're called anymore, but it kind of tastes like them too. But I can't remember what they're called, but anybody that tastes them probably know what I'm talking about. But uh, yeah, they're pretty good though. Uh, I would recommend picking some up if you can find them. So yeah. So back to you, Mr. Transaren38.